Have you ever noticed how some people seem to effortlessly navigate life's challenges, maintaining their composure and attracting success, while others struggle with constant drama and toxic relationships? If you think the answer lies in luck or circumstances, you're mistaken. The truth is high-value individuals have mastered the art of stoicism and learned how to cut toxic people out of their lives without creating unnecessary drama. This skill is not about being cold or unfeeling. It's about valuing yourself and your peace of mind above the chaos that toxic individuals bring. By the end of this video, you'll understand the 13 key principles that will transform you into a high-value person capable of maintaining healthy boundaries and attracting positive relationships. 1. Embrace self-sufficiency. At the core of a high-value individual's strength is self-sufficiency. This doesn't mean isolating yourself from others, but rather finding contentment and stability within. The ancient Stoic philosopher Epictetus wisely said, the key is to keep company only with people who uplift you, whose presence calls forth your best. This quote beautifully captures the essence of self-sufficiency in relationships. When you're emotionally self-sufficient, you don't rely on others for your happiness or self-worth. This independence becomes the foundation for your ability to cut toxic people out of your life without hesitation or regret. Cultivating self-sufficiency requires a commitment to personal growth and self-discovery. It involves developing your own interests and hobbies, setting personal goals, and learning to enjoy your own company. This process might involve spending time in solitude, engaging in activities that challenge and fulfill you, or pursuing knowledge and skills that enhance your sense of competence and self-reliance. As you become more comfortable with yourself, you'll find that you're less likely to tolerate toxic behavior from others simply out of fear of being alone. The power of self-sufficiency lies in the freedom it grants you. When you're not dependent on others for your sense of worth or happiness, you approach relationships from a position of strength, not desperation. You're able to choose your associations based on genuine connection and shared values, rather than clinging to toxic people out of fear or habit. This mindset shift is crucial in becoming a high-value individual who can maintain healthy boundaries and attract positive relationships. Remember, your relationship with yourself sets the tone for all other relationships in your life. Two, recognize toxic behaviors instantly. Identifying toxic behavior early is crucial in maintaining your peace and well-being. As Marcus Aurelius, the philosopher emperor, advised, the best revenge is to be unlike him who performed the injury. This perspective helps us focus on our own behavior rather than getting caught up in others' negativity. High-value individuals have developed a finely tuned radar for toxic behavior. They don't wait for situations to escalate. Instead, they identify red flags early and act swiftly to protect themselves. Toxic behaviors can manifest in many forms including constant criticism or negativity, manipulation through guilt or emotional blackmail, disrespect for boundaries, a tendency to create drama or conflict, jealousy, possessiveness, and a lack of accountability for one's actions. Recognizing these behaviors requires keen observation and a willingness to trust your instincts. Often, our gut feelings pick up on subtle cues that our conscious mind might overlook. By paying attention to how people make you feel and observing their patterns of behavior over time, you can sharpen your ability to spot toxic traits quickly. By honing this skill of instant recognition, you save yourself time, energy, and emotional turmoil. You're not caught off guard by manipulative tactics because you see them coming from afar. This clear-sightedness becomes your first line of defense against toxic influences. It allows you to make informed decisions about who you allow into your life and how much influence you permit them to have. Remember, recognition is the first step towards protection. By acknowledging toxic behavior for what it is, without trying to excuse or rationalize it, you empower yourself to make healthier choices in your relationships and interactions. Three, implement the three strikes rule. The three strikes rule is a balanced approach to dealing with toxic behavior that aligns with the stoic principle of justice. As Seneca wisely noted, the greatest remedy for anger is delay. This rule provides a structured way to give people a chance to correct their behavior while also protecting your own boundaries. It's not about being unforgiving, 
but about setting clear limits on what you'll tolerate in your relationships. Here's how the three strikes rule works. The first time someone exhibits toxic behavior, you take note of it internally. You don't necessarily react outwardly, but you become aware of the behavior and its impact on you. The second time it occurs, you clearly communicate your boundary. You express how the behavior affects you and make it clear that it's not acceptable. This gives the person an opportunity to recognize their mistake and make amends. If the behavior occurs a third time, you take decisive action to remove that person from your life or significantly limit their influence. This approach balances compassion with self-respect. It acknowledges that everyone makes mistakes and deserves a chance to improve, but it also sets a clear limit on how many chances you're willing to give. By following this rule, you avoid the trap of endless second chances that many fall into. You show others that your boundaries are firm and your self-respect is non-negotiable. This clarity not only protects you from ongoing toxic behavior, but also sends a powerful message about your values and expectations in relationships. 4. Master the art of indifference. Indifference, in the Stoic sense, doesn't mean not caring at all. Rather, it's about choosing what to care about wisely and not allowing yourself to be swayed by things outside your control. As Epictetus famously said, it's not what happens to you, but how you react to it that matters. This principle is particularly powerful when dealing with toxic people. High-value individuals understand that the opposite of love isn't hate, it's indifference. They don't engage in petty conflicts or seek revenge. Instead, they cultivate a sense of calm detachment towards toxic behavior. This indifference is a potent tool because it denies toxic individuals the emotional reaction they often crave. Many toxic behaviors are designed to provoke a response, whether it's anger, hurt, or drama. By responding with calm detachment, you rob these behaviors of their power. You're essentially saying, your actions don't control my emotions. This can be incredibly frustrating for toxic individuals who thrive on creating chaos and eliciting strong reactions from others. Mastering indifference doesn't mean becoming cold or uncaring. It means choosing where to invest your emotional energy wisely. You save your passion and care for those who deserve it, for the relationships and pursuits that truly matter to you. Practicing indifference involves developing emotional self-control. When faced with provocations, take a deep breath and pause before responding. Remind yourself that others' actions reflect on them, not on you. Focus on what you can control, your own thoughts and reactions. Over time, this practice of indifference will become a powerful shield protecting you from the drama and negativity that toxic people try to introduce into your life. 5. Cultivate a strong support network. While self-sufficiency is crucial, high-value individuals also recognize the importance of a quality support network. They understand the truth in Seneca's words. Associate with people who are likely to improve you. A strong support network acts as a buffer against toxic influences and reinforces your positive choices. When you're surrounded by people who uplift and inspire you, it becomes easier to recognize and reject negativity. Your standards naturally rise and you become less tolerant of toxic behavior. Building a strong support network requires being selective about the people you allow into your inner circle. High value individuals choose their friends and associates carefully, prioritizing quality over quantity in their relationships. They seek out people who share their values, support their goals, and contribute positively to their lives. This network might include close friends, family members, mentors, or like-minded individuals pursuing similar personal growth journeys. These relationships are characterized by mutual respect, genuine care, and a shared commitment to growth and positivity. Investing time in nurturing these positive relationships is crucial. Regular communication, acts of kindness, and being there for each other during both good times and challenges all contribute to strengthening these bonds. A strong support network not only provides emotional sustenance, but also serves as a sounding board and reality check when you're dealing with potentially toxic situations. The perspectives of trusted friends can help you maintain clarity and reinforce your resolve when it comes to cutting out toxic individuals. Remember, the company you keep shapes your perceptions and influences your decisions. 
By cultivating a network of positive, supportive people, you create an environment that naturally repels toxicity and fosters your growth as a high-value individual. 6. Embrace the power of silence. High-value individuals understand that not every provocation deserves a response. They wield silence as a powerful tool against toxic behavior, embodying the wisdom of Marcus Aurelius who said, you have power over your mind, not outside events. Realize this and you will find strength. Silence in this context is not a sign of weakness or submission. Instead, it's a demonstration of self-control and wisdom. It's the ability to resist the urge to engage in pointless arguments or to defend yourself against baseless accusations. When faced with drama or attempts to draw them into conflict, high-value individuals often choose to say nothing. This silence can be unsettling for toxic individuals who expect and thrive on emotional reactions. By refusing to engage, you deny them the attention and conflict they seek. Your silence speaks louder than any words could, conveying that you're above their petty games and manipulations. It's a clear message that you won't be baited into drama or drawn into their toxic narrative. Embracing the power of silence requires practice and self-discipline. It involves learning to sit with the discomfort of not having the last word or not defending yourself verbally. When someone tries to provoke you, take a deep breath and remind yourself that you have the power to choose your response. Sometimes, the most powerful response is no response at all. Let them sit with the uncomfortable silence their behavior has created. Over time, you'll find that this practice not only helps you avoid unnecessary conflict, but also gives you a sense of inner peace and control. You're no longer at the mercy of others' provocations. Instead, you're the master of your own reactions. 7. Develop a zero-tolerance policy for disrespect. High-value individuals have a clear, non-negotiable standard when it comes to respect. They embody the wisdom of Epictetus, who said, No, first, who you are, and then adorn yourself accordingly. This self-knowledge forms the foundation of their zero-tolerance policy for disrespect. They understand that allowing disrespect not only erodes their self-worth, but also invites further mistreatment. This policy isn't about being oversensitive or demanding perfection from others. Rather, it's about recognizing the fundamental importance of respect in any healthy relationship or interaction. Implementing a zero-tolerance policy for disrespect requires clarity about what respect means to you. It involves defining your boundaries clearly and communicating them assertively to others. When someone disrespects them, high-value individuals address it directly and firmly. They don't make excuses for the behavior or try to rationalize it away. Instead, they confront it head-on, making it clear that such behavior is unacceptable. If the disrespectful behavior continues despite clear communication, they have no qualms about cutting that person out of their life, regardless of the consequences or the person's status or relationship to them. This unwavering stance on respect sends a powerful message to others about how you expect to be treated. It sets the tone for all your relationships and interactions. While it may sometimes mean losing relationships that don't serve you, it ultimately attracts people who value and respect you. Remember, you teach people how to treat you. By consistently enforcing your boundaries and not tolerating disrespect, you create a life filled with more positive, respectful relationships. This not only enhances your well-being, but also sets an example for others, potentially inspiring them to raise their own standards for how they allow themselves to be treated. 8. Master the art of graceful exits. High-value individuals know how to remove themselves from toxic situations without creating a scene. They understand the wisdom in Seneca's words, he who does not know how to leave the stage spoils the whole play. This skill of making graceful exits is crucial in maintaining your dignity and peace of mind when dealing with toxic people or situations. It's about ending relationships or leaving situations that no longer serve you in a way that's firm, clear and drama-free. Mastering the art of graceful exits involves several key elements. First, it requires a clear decision to leave the situation or relationship. This decision should be made thoughtfully, not in the heat of emotion. Once the decision is made, high-value individuals plan their exit strategy, considering practical aspects like shared responsibilities or possessions. 
They then communicate their decision clearly and concisely, without room for debate or negotiation. The key is to state your intention to leave without engaging in lengthy explanations or arguments. This clarity denies toxic people the opportunity to manipulate you into staying or to create drama around your departure. Executing a graceful exit also involves maintaining your composure and dignity throughout the process. This means resisting the urge to lash out, seek revenge, or engage in petty behavior, even if the other person attempts to provoke you. Instead, focus on your own actions and maintain your integrity. After making your exit, follow through with your decision by maintaining minimal contact. Remember, every time you engage with a toxic person after deciding to leave, you open the door for more drama and negativity. By mastering the art of graceful exits, you maintain control over your life and your emotional well-being. You demonstrate to yourself and others that you value your peace of mind above the temporary discomfort of ending a toxic relationship. 9. Cultivate emotional intelligence. Emotional intelligence is a crucial skill for high-value individuals in navigating relationships and protecting themselves from toxic influences. As Marcus Aurelius wisely noted, you have power over your mind, not outside events. Realize this, and you will find strength. Emotional intelligence involves the ability to recognize, understand, and manage your own emotions, as well as the ability to recognize, understand, and influence the emotions of others. This skill is particularly valuable when dealing with toxic people, as it allows you to respond thoughtfully, rather than react impulsively to provocations. Developing emotional intelligence starts with self-awareness. This means regularly reflecting on your emotions, understanding your triggers, and recognizing your patterns of behavior. It involves learning to accurately identify and name your emotions rather than being overwhelmed by them. As you become more aware of your own emotional landscape, you'll also become better at reading others' emotional states. This empathy allows you to understand others' perspectives and motivations even when they're acting in toxic ways. However, understanding doesn't mean excusing bad behavior. Instead, it gives you insight that can inform your responses and decisions. High emotional intelligence also involves the ability to regulate your emotions, especially in challenging situations. This doesn't mean suppressing your feelings, but rather managing them effectively. When faced with toxic behavior, emotionally intelligent individuals can stay calm and composed. They don't let others' negativity dictate their emotional state. Instead, they respond thoughtfully and strategically. This ability to maintain emotional equilibrium in the face of toxicity is a powerful tool. It allows you to make clear-headed decisions about your relationships and interactions rather than being swayed by momentary emotions. By cultivating emotional intelligence, you not only protect yourself from toxic influences, but also enhance your ability to form and maintain healthy, positive relationships. 10. Embrace the philosophy of addition by subtraction. High-value individuals understand that sometimes, to gain more, you need to let go. This philosophy of addition by subtraction aligns closely with the Stoic principle of focusing on what's within our control. As Epictetus advised, he is a wise man who does not grieve for the things which he has not, but rejoices for those which he has. In the context of relationships and personal growth, this means recognizing that holding on to toxic people or situations can drain your energy and hold you back from growth. By cutting these negative elements out, you create space for positive influences and opportunities. Embracing this philosophy requires a shift in mindset. Instead of fearing loss or clinging to familiar but unhealthy patterns, high-value individuals see removing toxic elements as a form of self-investment. They understand that every no to a toxic situation is a yes to their well-being and growth. This might mean ending a long-standing but unhealthy friendship, leaving a job that stifles your potential, or letting go of habits that no longer serve you. While these decisions can be difficult in the short term, they ultimately lead to greater happiness and success. To apply this principle in your life, regularly assess your relationships and commitments. Ask yourself whether each element in your life is contributing to your growth and happiness or holding you back. 
Be honest with yourself about what's working and what isn't. When you identify something that's negatively impacting your life, be willing to let it go, trusting that the void will be filled with something better. Remember, nature abhors a vacuum. When you remove negative influences from your life, you create space for positive ones to enter. This process of conscious pruning and growth is essential in becoming a high-value individual who attracts positive relationships and opportunities. 11. Develop a strong sense of self. Knowing yourself deeply is crucial in maintaining boundaries and making wise choices in relationships. As Seneca sagely observed, we suffer more often in imagination than in reality. A strong sense of self helps you distinguish between real threats and imagined ones and gives you the confidence to stand firm in your values and decisions. High-value individuals have a clear understanding of who they are, what they stand for, and where they're going in life. This self-awareness acts as a shield against toxic influences and manipulation. Developing a strong sense of self is an ongoing process of self-discovery and reflection. It involves regularly examining your values, beliefs, goals, and boundaries. This might include journaling, meditation, or engaging in deep conversations with trusted friends or mentors. As you gain clarity about who you are and what you stand for, you'll find it easier to make decisions that align with your true self. You'll be less swayed by others' opinions or manipulations because you have a strong internal compass guiding your choices. A strong sense of self also involves accepting both your strengths and weaknesses. It's about embracing your uniqueness and not trying to conform to others' expectations. When you're comfortable with who you are, you're less likely to tolerate toxic behavior or stay in situations that don't serve you. You'll have the confidence to set and maintain healthy boundaries and to walk away from relationships or environments that don't align with your values. Remember, as Marcus Aurelius said, look well into thyself. There is a source of strength which will always spring up if thou wilt always look. By continually nurturing and developing your sense of self, you create a solid foundation from which to navigate life's challenges and relationships. This self-knowledge becomes your anchor in turbulent times and your guide in making decisions that truly serve your well-being and growth. 12. Master the art of detachment. Detachment, in the Stoic sense, is about maintaining perspective and emotional balance. As Marcus Aurelius advised, you have power over your mind, not outside events. Realize this and you will find strength. This skill is crucial in dealing with toxic people and situations. Detachment doesn't mean not caring. Rather, it's about caring in a way that doesn't compromise your emotional well-being. Practicing detachment involves observing your thoughts and emotions without getting caught up in them. When faced with a toxic situation, take a step back mentally. Remind yourself that you can't control others' actions, only your response to them. This perspective allows you to make clearer, more rational decisions about how to proceed. It prevents you from getting dragged into unnecessary drama or emotional turmoil. Mastering detachment also means learning to separate your self-worth from others' opinions or actions. Toxic people often try to manipulate by attacking your self-esteem or creating a sense of obligation. By maintaining emotional detachment, you can recognize these tactics for what they are without internalizing them. Remember, you can care about people without taking responsibility for their emotions or actions. This balanced approach allows you to offer support when appropriate while maintaining clear boundaries to protect your own well-being. 13. Embrace continuous self-improvement. Personal growth is a lifelong journey and high-value individuals understand this deeply. As Epictetus said, no man is free who is not master of himself. By constantly improving yourself, you naturally outgrow toxic influences and attract more positive relationships. This commitment to self-improvement raises your standards in all areas of life, making you less tolerant of negativity and more aligned with growth-oriented individuals. Embracing continuous self-improvement involves setting regular goals for personal and professional development. This might include reading widely, seeking out new knowledge and skills, or challenging yourself to step out of your comfort zone. It's about being curious about the world and yourself, always looking for opportunities to learn and grow. 
As you evolve, you'll find that your perspective on relationships and life challenges shifts. What once seemed tolerable may now be clearly recognized as toxic. Remember, the more you invest in your own growth, the less dependent you become on others for validation or happiness. This independence makes it easier to cut ties with toxic individuals when necessary. It also attracts like-minded individuals who value personal growth and positive relationships. By focusing on becoming the best version of yourself, you create a life that naturally repels toxicity and attracts positivity. In conclusion, becoming a high-value individual capable of cutting toxic people out without drama is a journey of self-discovery and personal growth. It requires developing a strong sense of self, mastering your emotions, and being willing to prioritize your well-being over the comfort of maintaining toxic relationships. Remember the words of Marcus Aurelius, very little is needed to make a happy life. It is all within yourself, in your way of thinking. By implementing these 13 principles, you'll not only free yourself from negativity, but also attract more positive, fulfilling relationships into your life. The path may not always be easy, but the rewards of living as a high-value individual are immeasurable. As you apply these stoic secrets consistently, you'll find yourself becoming more resilient, confident, and at peace. Your life will transform, not through dramatic changes, but through the quiet power of wisdom and self-respect. Start your journey today. Embrace these principles, apply them with patience and persistence, and watch as your life unfolds into the drama-free, successful existence you deserve. Remember, the power to create a life of value and peace lies within you. Take the first step and let the wisdom of the Stoics guide you towards a brighter, more fulfilling future. If you have made it this far, comment down below with the word 100% to confirm that you have received the knowledge from this video. For more interesting topics, make sure you watch the recommended video that you see on the screen right now. Thanks for watching.